Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. The Bonanza G36 Improvement Mod just got a big update. Want to know more? Then stick around for today's episode of 2020 Flight Simmers. Welcome back to Microsoft Flight Sim, everyone. And today we're going to go over the G36 Bonanza Improvement Project. But make sure you go down below and hit that subscribe button and tick that little bell. So I think one of the biggest changes in the latest update is that the Bonanza has its own aircraft now. So when you go over to the aircraft menu and you're searching through the propeller planes, when you scroll down, you'll see the normal Beechcraft Bonanza G36 over here. And below that, we'll have the G36 Improvement Bonanza. Now, links will be down below for the mod update. Let's go over some of the changes in the current version of the Improvement mod. So first they've added functionality to the hangar module, which they are now able to save engine hours, miles flown, count down to the annual 100 hour service. They've also tweaked some things in the fuel flow. And I think one of the other biggest things, they've added the Sim Update 8 propeller modeling. So that is really cool because the initial tests show that the aircraft is now at most only one knot away from book figures. So let's talk about some of the other features that the improvement mod is going to change over the default flight model. Flight dynamic and performance is completely changed on this. So they adjusted the climb and the cruise performance to match the actual Bonanza POH charts, adjusted flap and gear drags. They've slightly reduced the pitch effect due to elevator deflection and prop wash, slightly increased the nose wheel steering angle, added drag due to cow flaps, decreased yaw sensitivity, and the list goes on. They've also adjusted some of the engine and fuel system parameters, as well as some of the other electrical systems, autopilot tweaks, and the list really does go on. Again, links will be down in the description for this. I suggest you go over there and take a look. All right, so let's talk about the roadmap for the future for the Bonanza Improvement Mod. So please note that none of these are set in stone or confirmed as definitively happening. Just things that they would like to get accomplished for the future. So a couple of things that they are looking into testing for the future of the project would be things like spark plug fouling, hangar module further development, oil simulation, electrical system deeper simulations, wear and tear on the aircraft, and further aircraft failures. All right, so I think that's going to finish us up for today. If anybody has any questions, please leave those down below in the comment section. And if you haven't done so already, make sure you hit that subscribe button while you're down there and tick that little bell. Well, to all my flight flightsiver friends around the world, keep the blue side up, and we will see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching, everybody.